Hello, my name is Russell Toll. In Professor Harold Scott MacDonald Coxeter's classic work, Regular Polytopes, we learn that the n maris polar zonohedra form solid shadows of n-dimensional cubes cast into three dimensions. The unit n-cube measures the unit of n-dimensional content, that is, the unit 1-cube, a segment, measures length, the unit 2-cube, a square, measures area, and the unit 3-cube, a cube, measures volume. An n-cube can cast an orthogonal shadow into any s-dimensional subspace of the n-space. It is worth considering what the s-dimensional content of such a shadow might be. What type of projection maximizes the content of a shadow? What type of projection minimizes the content of a shadow? Here we visit several zonohedral tilings related to polar zonohedra. In each case, a single undivided polar zonohedron lies at the center of the tiling. This central zonohedron is surrounded by other zonohedra of various types. Some of these other zonohedra have been stripped away, so we can see the internal structure of the tiling. If a single polar zonohedron is a shadow of an n-cube, what then are tilings such as these? The answer has to do with building up n-cubes of edge 2, or three or more from unit n cubes. For instance, we can build a square of edge two from four squares of edge one. Well, that's all for now. Thank you.